three trace to sort through with the tropics. Potential tropical cyclone number two, still a thing, has not become a depression yet. It's skirted past the northern fringe of Venezuela. It's moving west. It's still a very fast clip, 20 miles an hour, 40 mile an hour winds as it goes through Central America and then out into the Pacific Basin thankfully well away from South Florida. Here in the central tropical Atlantic and moving toward a windward island impact over the weekend is a tropical wave. It has a 30% chance of developing, but again, I don't think it's gonna have a shelf life much after it interacts with the windwards in the Caribbean. So it's gonna encounter sheer interaction with land and hopefully will not be something we're talking about next week, fingers crossed. And we have a system in the Gulf of Mexico, which is really being enhanced with the very hot waters of the Gulf, which are running in the mid 80s right now. It is gonna mean another bounce of rain for parts of Southern Texas and Mexico. This one could become a depression before it kind of eases into that area between the borders of the two.